Hey, how's it going everybody? Today we're gonna to be taking a look at how to schedule automatic reboots on your Windows machine. So let's just jump right into it. Here's the machine that I'll be performing these automated tasks on. I'm going to click the Windows icon and just type in task schedule, task scheduler. And if that doesn't show up for whatever reason, you can also hit Windows key R and type in task SCHD dot MSC. And that will bring up the task scheduler application. And from here, what we can do in the right corner is we can click create a task. You'll also notice there's a create basic task. This is just a watered down version of create task. I like to do create task because it gives you some more options and a little bit more flexibility. So I'm going to give a name and it's just going to be weekly reboots. I don't really think I need a description here because that's <laughs> pretty self-explanatory, but obviously you're, you're free to leave a description here uh, if, you, if you'd like. And then we can see here, it says when running the task, use the following user account and it shows my, my user profile. Now, in this case, I want this task to run whether or not I'm signed in. So I'm going to click run whether user is logged out or not. And I'm also actually, I'm going to leave everything else default. I don't need highest privileges for the reboot command. Um, so we can, we can pretty much leave that as is. Now what I'm going to do is head over to the triggers tab here and I'm going to click new and I'm going to state when I want this event to trigger. So in this particular case, it'll be on a schedule. I want it to be weekly and 1.24 a.m. is fine with me. I don't really care when this machine reboots and I'll just say every Monday. Now, if you wanted it to recur every two weeks or every three weeks, you could type two here or three. In this case, one week is good enough for me. Uh, you have a couple more options down here, such as like setting an expiration date for this task. I don't really need that. And if you just want your computer to reboot on a weekly basis, you probably don't need that either. So we can just click OK. Now we're going to head to the actions tab and we're going to click new. And this is where we actually state what we want to happen. So in this case, I want to run the shutdown command and I want to pass through a couple of arguments here as well. So the first argument is going to be um, forward slash F. That's just going to force all the applications or any programs that are running to close. So we have a graceful reboot. And I'm also going to pass through forward slash R. That's going to launch the reboot itself. If we forget that slash R, then the machine will just shut down. So that's no good to us. I'm going to click OK now. And under the conditions tab here, there's a few more options. If, you're, if your computer falls asleep, you may want to wake the computer to run this task. In this particular case, I don't have sleep enabled, so I'm going to just leave all this as is. And with the settings, again, you have a couple more options. You can add some sort of persistency here. If the task fails, you can restart every, you know, every minute or however long you want. In this case, I don't think that's necessary. You can also run the task as soon as possible after a schedule start is missed. Again, this machine is going to be on pretty much 24 seven. So don't think I need that either. I'm going to click OK and I'm just going to provide my credentials here. And as we can see, the task is now created and it says at 1:24 a.m. every Monday of every week, this computer will reboot. And when it does successfully run for the first time, this date will be updated here. And this is pretty handy to see if it's actually on schedule and working as expected. But yeah, this is how you schedule automatic reboots on Windows and it's pretty handy. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll hopefully see you guys in the next video. Peace out.